Hey guys, what's up? JP back with another acoustic guitar lesson. This time we got, um, what is it here? Respond, Travis Green, really good one. I never heard it before. This was a request, so never heard him before, but he sounds pretty awesome. So I think I'm going to check out some more of his stuff. See if I can learn a few other things and maybe find some easier chords for stuff for you guys, as I normally try to do. Anywho, this one is actually not that hard. It sounds hard because he's finger picking, but really, if you just slow down your actual picking with a pick, it will sound the same. You just have to slow it down or speed it up, one of the two when you're doing it, or only hit certain chords. Just don't strum the whole thing like a, like a maniac. Um, Anywho, so yeah, we only actually have three chords for this, and it's, it's pretty simple. It's pretty straightforward. We got our G major. So I'm going to have two fingers down here on my third fret, fifth and sixth strings. And then just like a regular G, you got your uh, index finger on your second string, second fret, middle finger on your first top string on your third fret. To your C at nine, which is the exact same thing. These two fingers don't move at all. So if you're a beginner, this stays simple. Go to your C at nine. And then we'll also have an E minor 7th or whatever it's called. Again, these two fingers stay in that same spot and they'll just jump up. Both of them will be on that 2nd fret, your 2nd and 3rd strings down there. So then you'll go back and forth from your E minor. And then you'll go back to the, the, the verses, which are just G and your C at 9. And for strumming and stuff in this, again, it sounds like you're, like he finger picks. He's finger picking the top. I'm not very good at finger picking, so I'm not even going to try. I'm better with a pick. But you can still make it sound very similar without actually finger picking. Again, just slow, slow it on down there. So if I do this a little bit slowly for you, you start off with your G there. And I'm mainly for that, I'm just hitting like second string from the top and then second and third one on here when I'm doing upstrokes so and then just the middle ones but as long as you're like gentle with it it'll basically sound the same thing as finger picking or as long as you can like speed it up maybe a little bit that might help you too but you have to do double time I know that's confusing, especially if you're a beginner, but this song is not very complicated. It's mainly just G to your, um, to your C at 9, and then to your G to your C at 9, two or three times. You have to do it based on lyrics. I don't know all the lyrics specifically, but... And then for your main chorus part, you'd be, going, you'd be using your E minor as well to your G. And at the end of it, you go to your C, and you go back in your verses again. Anyways, I hope I didn't say that too quickly. I can slow it down if you want me to, or, or just play it through a little bit, just so you can get the rhythm. So from your G to your C at night. your E minor with the two fingers to your G to your C and two fingers maybe to your C at nine and then back to your G <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure exactly which one it switches to at that point but if you listen to it, you should be able to hear it and play it at the same time. It's only three chords, so if you're a beginner, it looks like on the video that he's playing it, like, again, he's finger picking, so you'd imagine it's complicated, but it's actually just those three chords, and you can still do it with a pick. So, anyways, I hope I helped. If you have any questions at all, uh, feel free to drop them down below. This was a request, so if you have any requests yourself,
drop them down below. If you can't find like a lesson for anything, I'd be happy to try and help you if this is helpful to you at all. So anyways, GP out. Have a great day, guys.